Hello you guys, what is up? So for today's video, I'm gonna be going downtown Vancouver. If you guys didn't know, I live in a city just a little bit away from like the downtown Vancouver area. So we're gonna be going downtown today. I'm gonna give you guys a day in the city. We're gonna go shopping. We're gonna go get something to eat. We're gonna go to the beach. So we're gonna be doing a lot of fun things and y'all are gonna come with me. So it's gonna be such a good day and it's gonna be sunny today. Thank God, cause that does not happen often here in Vancouver. Let me show you guys my OOTD for the day. My room is like a mess because I was scavenging for clothing. <laughs> I'm wearing these jeans from Shein. These are the jeans that I'm obsessed with. And then I have this flannel on that I got thrifting. And then this sweater is just a zip up, I think like from Walmart or something. This I got ages ago from Forever 21. And my jewelry is from Amazon. And then I have a, I don't know if you guys can see, but I have a clip in and it's from Amazon as well. So yeah, that's the fit for today. Let's go. I'm so excited. Me and Joel kind of tried to coordinate our outfits because he put on a hoodie and a flannel before me. I'm like, hey, why don't we match? So then I put on my flannel. <laughs> That's cute. So we just currently got to Starbucks and we were gonna go to the drive-thru. That's why we came to this specific one. Usually there's like a really long lineup at this drive-thru. I expected there to be a lineup. A lineup meaning five, ten minutes. But this lineup is literally wrapped around the whole town. We're like, we're not gonna wait in this lineup. So I'm just waiting in the car because Joe went to go get our drinks because we didn't want to leave. We have a lot of stuff in the car so we didn't want to just leave our car parked here. So I'm just staying in waiting for him to get the drinks because it's gonna be so much quicker if we just go in and order as opposed to waiting literally probably half an hour in the lineup because that's just gonna be a big waste of time so just awaiting upon my ice caramel macchiato <laughs> okay so joel clutched up with the ice caramel macchiato the thing that i hate about these drinks is like when you're on the go is that they don't stir them and it's like they're so like filled to the top that you can't just shake it because it'll literally explode so we're gonna compromise today and we're gonna be using my glasses i guess as a stir <laughs> i don't know what else to use why do you think they don't stir them i don't know i know why it is why it's because the girls who go to Starbucks like to see the pretty colors in their drink. They like to see it like this. I'd rather this be mixed to be completely it is, uh, honest. It's like, as you would say, aesthetic. <laughs> but I'd rather this be mixed. <laughs> they should ask like mixed or... Aesthetic. <laughs> <laughs> We're actually doing this with my glasses, but I actually want to wear my glasses today. So this is going <gasps> to... Oh, it's top. Ah! top. Ah, no! This is dangerous, Joel. S Hold up. Oh my God. This is not okay. Lid me. Lid you. God damn, holy shit, man. They really, Why we should really ask for a pre-mix next time. That does slap though. Was it worth it? No, but kind of was. Starting off the day right with a spill. Typical day in my life. Okay, I'm just thankful that it didn't spill on my white shirt or my jeans. You gotta look at the positive things. And the positive thing about this is that it didn't spill on anything too important. So we're doing good, we are doing good. Okay, we're gonna start driving now, so peace. So we just got here. It took us like an hour. It took us a while to find parking, but we're parked now. We're good. We're safe. It just like almost stresses me out to drive in this city just because it's so small. So many people walking, so many cars. It's just so much happening that it literally stresses me out. Um, but yeah, anyways, I need to literally piss my pants right now. I didn't even get to finish my drink because I need to go pee so bad that I was just like, I can't drink anymore because I'm literally gonna piss my pants and that stresses me out I even more. How <laughs> pissed you will need to pee, okay. Uh -oh. Alright, so we just went pee. I literally was gonna piss my pants. I think I actually pissed my pants a little bit. But now we're in the mall. We're gonna do some shopping. So hopefully I don't do too much damage, but we're gonna have to see. This is so cute. I think this is like the Prada dupe, you know, the really like the Prada one. It's so cute. Oh my god. We're in Urban Outfitters, by the way. Tote bags are so in right now, and this is literally like a must-have. Let's go. Cute tote bag, you know, for the summer. Oh, it's so cute. Oh my god. This is the cutest thing if I did ever see, the cutest dress. It is so cute. I see they have like so many, so many spring stuff out right now. I can't, like it's so cute. Like, this is such a cute top for oh, spring or summer. 
brown also is really in right now and I just need to get a whole bunch of brown stuff because it's so in right now. Also, these type of flary pants are really in right now. A cute like matching bottom with a matching top like that would be so cute. Honestly, at this point, I just want a whole new wardrobe. Like I asked. So this girl came up to me in Urban Outfitters and complimented my flannel and she was so sweet so I told her I had a YouTube because she asked me where I got it and I'm like oh my god like it's on my YouTube channel and so I gave her my YouTube so if you're watching this you are so nice yeah thank you for your compliment okay so we did a little bit of damage at Brandy because I just like can't resist everything in there is just too cute for me not to buy so we bought <laughs> It's windy. Oh, there you go. Thank God it's a Tuesday, so the streets are not like overwhelmingly busy. Honestly, Zara was a literal shit show. Like there were a million people and a million things flying everywhere. Like I swear things were flying. People were holding piles this big and it was literally a shit show. Nothing was in order. I couldn't find anything. So I'm like, let's just go. It was, it was bad. Currently on our way to Five Guys, there's music. Where's it coming from? Is that a speaker? Oh, he's over there. Right there. It's already three o'clock. So we're done shopping for today. We need to eat. All right, you guys, we are currently in Five Guys waiting for our burgers. I'm so excited to eat because I'm literally starving. Okay, so we're just regrouping back in the car because we're gonna go to the beach now and watch the sunset So I'm gonna do a little outfit change. Well, not outfit change I'm just gonna get dressed in like warmer shit So I'm gonna put my hair down and put my toque on because it's like way colder than we expected Okay, so I think I'm gonna take this off and then just put my puffer on instead Let's go to the beach, beach. Let's go to the way They say what da 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 Gotta drink, drink my bitches all made da 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 Go. We're heading down to Sunset Beach. Hopefully we get a good sunset. Hence the Sunset Beach. But yeah. I'm literally wearing a face mask right now. Not for any reason, but the fact that my face is literally freezing off. Like, holy shit. It's literally Antarctica winds right now with a high of negative freaking 17. It's so cold, but hopefully it's worth it and we get a good sunset. High hopes. Oh, it's actually freezing. It's cold. It's I'll admit. It's so cold. I, I think it's just the wind that gets me. It's really the wind. Holy shit. I just realized I was filming that. Well, the, it was so zoomed in, but my hands are gonna freeze off. Look at them. Oh my God, they're so cute. Better walk against the wind. We got some palm trees to remind me that I should be in Hawaii right now. <laughs> We're currently just sitting waiting for the sunset. We're kind of like on a hill just like right in front of the beach Because it's just so windy like right near the water and then maybe when the Sun starts to set we'll go a little closer But we can still see it like perfect from here. So we're good. We're chilling. We're bundled up. Here's a little view It's actually a really beautiful day, but it's just super cold and windy so All right, you guys, we made it back. We just got to the car. It is literally freezing. We stopped at Tim Hortons, what a Canadian thing to do. And I got a hot chocolate and Joel got a coffee. He capped up a double. Yeah, just to warm ourselves up for the ride home. And then when we get home, I'm gonna give you guys a haul of what I got. So yeah, we're gonna drive now and I'll see you guys at home. Okay, she's 
she's back. She's back and better than ever. She's back with less money in her bank account. With a haul, okay? So I did some damage at a Ritzia and I mean Brandy, this is a brandy bag. And I also did a little bit of damage at a Ritzia. You guys are probably wanting a haul, so I'm gonna give one to you and it's gonna be a try on haul, so you're welcome. So excited! Okay, you guys should know that I'm obsessed with the color brown. It's an actual obsession right now that got a little out of hand today. I don't know what, what's with the color brown in me. We're in love right now. Yeah, I'm gonna get changed and show you guys the cute ass stuff. Okay, one sec. Okay, so here's the first shirt that I got. Surprise, surprise. It's in brown. Okay, just how cute is this? This is from Brandy and it's just like a tank top, a plain brown tank top. You can never go wrong with a simple basic colored tank top because you can literally wear this with almost any bottom. I feel like the colors black, white, brown, beige, like the neutral tones can literally go with any pants. So you literally can't go wrong with just getting a plain basic tank top because I know that it's going to be worn in my future references. Any season, anytime, anywhere, this will be worn. So I know it's going to go to good use. And yes, Brandy does have tank tops on the like the expensive side, I would honestly say, just because like you can get a tank top off sheen for like $2 versus this, which is like $20. But it is better quality and it will last me longer, which is good. Yeah, I just know I'm going to be literally wearing this every single day. So get used to me in this shirt because you're going to be seeing it a lot. Okay, so the next thing that I got is I actually haven't even tried this on yet because we weren't allowed to try anything on in the store just because of like COVID and everything. It's a brown sweatshirt. It's a zip up and it's just so cute. Like look at the inside. It's like fuzzy kind of. Oh my goodness. I didn't have even tried this on yet. So I'm kind of excited Shut up. How freaking cute is this? I feel like the oversizedness of it is perfect. This is the size large to extra large and they also had a small to medium, but the small to medium honestly looked tiny compared to this. And if, if I put this in the wash, I know it's gonna shrink anyway. So it is a little bit like on the bigger side, but I do love me some oversized pieces. As you guys know, I literally like anything oversized. Holy crap, this is just so cute. So if I took this brownness and then put my cow bag on it, Oh my god, I just feel like this just looks so cute with this bag. You can literally, again, wear this with anything. Therefore, I'm gonna be wearing this every day as well. So, get used to it, honey. Next thing I got are these sweatpants. I'm gonna put them on for you guys, so just give me a sec. Okay, well, I guess at this point, you can literally call me a literal brown hair now. But I love it. It's literally so cute. This honestly all goes really well together, and it honestly looks cute all together as a matching set. And I'm literally obsessed with matching sets. Let me tell you, when I have the bank account to get matching sets, it's all I'm gonna wear every single single day every single hour of the day comfiness plus fashion it's like a mon is it called monochrome i think when you're just wearing one color i think it's called monochrome i love it these sweatpants are really like good quality they're so comfy couldn't ask for better sweatpants let me like show you guys a little bit better oh <gasps> stop i'm gonna wear this like all together all the time i've been obsessed with two colors lately and it's been brown and like green i don't know how to describe the tone of green but it's like the like a really nice tone of green and brown are my two favorite colors right now i feel like they're just so in so cute i feel like we're sleeping on these colors anyways i got one more thing so this whole set is from brandy just for reference and then I got this shirt from Aritzia. I'll put it on for you guys. Okay, so this is the shirt that I got from Aritzia. I know you guys are probably thinking like, oh my god, like it's so basic. But shirts like this, I feel like you can, they'll never go out of style and you can wear them with literally everything. This style of shirt I'm obsessed with. I have like only like a couple other shirts with this exact style, but I wanted one that was just like simple, plain, so I can wear it with anything. And this is literally perfect. I could throw it on with some sweatpants, some shorts, literally anything. And it just makes you look kind of put together. It's cute. It's fat fashionable it's fun so i couldn't go wrong with this and the quality is good even though it was a little more expensive because it was a ritzia i don't think i could find anything this good quality like Shein or like any other cheaper website so it's gonna be something that will never go out of style so i'll wear for like years to come so that's kind of my thought process when buying clothes that are a little bit more expensive but Anyways, that's all that I got. I guess I didn't get like too much, but still did some damage. I can't go downtown without spending money because Brandy is only downtown. That's our only store nearby. And then Zara as well. Honestly, I didn't get anything from Zara. I had a high hopes going in there and I was really disappointed. It was a mess. Everything was just everywhere and I couldn't find anything and it was just very disappointing, but it's okay. 
But anyways, I'm gonna end off today's video here. I hope you guys enjoyed my day in downtown Vancouver, in the city. Yeah, I need to get out more often. This is a sign for you to go explore your own city and I hope you liked coming along with me, exploring mine today. Yeah, let me know what kind of videos you guys wanna see next. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Have a great night or day whenever you're watching this. I love you guys so much. Ooh, oh my God. If I wore this with my sweater and my shirt, I would literally be a fuzzy teddy bear. Oh my God. <gasps> Dude, I would actually be a real life teddy bear, okay? Stay tuned for this outfit coming up next. See you guys later. Ew, what the frick was that? Oh, oh, oh.